everybody, how you going? Uh, so I'm here to collect some sacred water. I have to make holy water or blessed water or sacred water. Uh, so I'm here at the stream. Um, and I'm going to show you how I do it, how I collect the water and the prayers and stuff I use. Um, yeah, because I thought you would, would enjoy that. Uh, so that's pretty much what I'm going to do. And, uh, and I'll show you the process that I go through uh, to collect the water. Um, maybe on a later stream, I'll show you um, the other blessings when I get back to the to the house, you know, or if I go to the church or wherever, you know. Uh, but I'll show you the rest of the blessing another day. Uh, but this this part is just to collect the water uh, that you need to make it. All right, uh, one second. Grandfather, I am far from my sacred bones in the land of our ancestors. I am far from the homeland. And I earn to return to the bloodline. However, at this time, my duty calls me to be here. So I need your wisdom and your guidance and your help to collect this water so that I may help others as you have instructed. I put you at the top of the circle for your guidance and your knowledge and your blessings. I put myself in the center, Grandfather, so that I can see all around me and you can see me, so that we can work together in order to achieve the ends to what we need. I put my hawk beside to watch that nothing negative can come. I put my mountain lion on the other side to protect the pathways to make sure that we are safe. And of course, I put Alba, the white wolf, my total, to protect me while I gather the water. I ask for my grandfather and my animal totems to bless the water that I gather today. See you, see you. Amen. I'll show you the, the area. Because I just realized some of you haven't seen the spot I picked. Uh, but anyway, there's a trail coming down. And this is just a gorgeous spot uh, that I found. Where it's got everything that you need. Uh, we've got, well, you'll hear it in the prayers. So I won't bother telling you. But all the elementals are here, and um, it's a great spot. So, uh, we'll get at it. Now, I'm making two different types of water today. Mm. Okay, the silver one is basically for healing. So, uh, blessing the land, helping spirits pass, uh, helping spirits to to find peace, that kind of stuff. The other one is, uh, in the gold one, is more of a, um, getting rid of stuff, right? So, two different purposes, two different, uh, use the same prayer. So, it's good. <laughs> to the fire, the sun, thank you blessing this water and giving life to all things around and helping us to survive each day. Thank you Earth for allowing us this channel for the water to come. Thank you Water for blessing us and giving us the life energy we need every day. Thank you Wood for keeping everything bound tight and keeping everything together and giving us a reason to grow. And thank you eating the poisons in the air to help wind create the oxygen we need to survive. Thank you to all five elementals for all you do for us. Thank you, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. I ask that you bless this container, bless this water, bless this endeavor to collect the water I need to help others as you so direct me. Yeah, amen.
Uh, so, we got the two water containers filled up. And those are the blessings for the grandfather's prayers and blessing the elementals and asking for the Lord himself, uh, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit to bless the water so that we can capture the water and the essence of all that is good in order to fight all that is not. <clears throat> Spirits, thank you. Thank you very much for this blessing. Thank you for allowing me the honor of helping others. Thank you for giving me the honor of look which. Thank you, Brother Raven. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to do the things that I do. I leave you some tobacco in order that you may use that energy for anything that you need. See you, see you, Amen. <clears throat> okay guys so that's it uh, that's how I do the water uh, collecting um, if you'd like more in depth or more analytical or anything else like that or like to know more about uh, water collecting and what I do with it next and stuff uh, just leave a comment below say we'd love to watch the next step of preparing the water for service and I will be more than happy to share that with you. Um, yeah, so anyway, hope you enjoyed today. Uh, it's been a glorious day. Uh, I feel really energized here and, and I feel the water is very uh, good and solid. So yeah, this should be pretty good. All right, blessings to all. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Hey, guys. <laughs> oh, that was a bit of a jaunt. Uh, just heading back now um yeah so that was a bit of work but uh, that went really nice and that was a very nice place so yeah so i hope you enjoyed that I love this place. There's so many spirits here. But, um, someone's walking behind me. I got slippers on, okay? <laughs> Man, so I know it's not my feet that I hear uh, behind me. I don't know if you can hear it or not. Hang on. There. See, I got slippers. Those are those are hard shoes. <laughs> uh, well, yeah. So anyway, they uh, I always like it because this is a very good spot and there's a lot of very nice spits to hang out here. And none of them are trapped, you know. Uh, they just love the area, so they hang out here and stuff. Um. Yeah, so it's a, it's a really nice spot. Uh, never get too many, too many nasty. There's like one or two areas around here. That's that's in a bit. Um, that's not so nice, but. Where's that thing? That's weird. Listen. There's like two or three different uh, stepping patterns. I don't know if you can hear them or not. I couldn't tell you. Uh, but <laughs> but I, certain, I certainly can hear them. Um, oh. Okay. Well, I'll get to the bench. I'll have to sit down. Uh. Lots of mosquitoes out here. Uh. But yeah, so... Like I say, I, I've done lots of investigations here. Uh, just because it's a wonderful place and the spirits always interact. And uh, they usually get some pretty good EVPs and stuff like that here. Um, matter of fact, there's a few few uh, super good ones that, you know, I'll never forget. So, yeah. Oh, 
But yeah, this is one of my, my favorite haunts, <laughs> as they were. Because it's peaceful, you know, more than anything. Hello? If you want to say hi, you can just talk in the microphone here. You want to say hello? Say hello. He's walking right beside me. I don't know. I can feel him. And uh, oddly, uh, sometimes you just don't see him, but I can feel it. And there's a... Uh, you know, like when you look across a hot grass and you get that steamy effect? That's what this one looks like. That's walking, <laughs> walking beside me. Anyway, whew, there's my, there it is, almost made it to the bench, <laughs> hmm. so we'll get there and we'll sit down, uh, chit chat for a minute. Hmm. Okay, so let me get comfortable here. All right, so that's uh, that's how I get water. That's what I do. I go out and gotta do it before dark, you know. Either that, um, three times a day actually. When the sun first comes up and kisses the water, you get it. In the evening when the sun's going down, you can get it. Or right at midnight basically when the moon is high. Um, those are the three best times that I, I believe, I find. Uh, to get the purest source. Uh, but anyway, that's just my belief, but it's not uh, written in stone anywhere. It's <laughs> just my belief, you know. Uh, for what I work. And those prayer, the prayers I do and everything else. Like I say, I've been doing it 50 some odd years and it's always worked for me, never let me down. So, you know, whether you believe or disbelieve, doesn't matter because I know what works for me. So that's basically it. And if something works for you, then you know what? That's all that matters to So, um, yeah. But I just thought I'd share what I do and, and how I collect the water and stuff like that. And so I'll go home and I'll do some prayers with the water and, and things and then do the final blessing and then it'll be ready. So that's it. That's it for getting the water. So hope you enjoyed that. I'm just gonna have a wee bit of a rest here uh, for a couple minutes. I head back up to the vehicle and then I'm gonna be heading off. So uh, we'll talk to you real soon. Blessings everybody.